Hello to everyone, especially to the students who enrolled in College of Education, Major Maths, and the Junior High students. This is your topic in algebra. This is radicals. So as you notice, there are uh, two radicals in the numerator and the denominator. So two from numerator and denominator. So all we have to do is we just rationalize the denominator. So that's why I will give you a specific solution or a specific discussion so that you may, you may understand properly. Okay, I will start my discussion. So I have 3 square root of 3 over 2 minus square root of 5. As what I said, I need to rationalize the denominator. To rationalize the denominator, find the conjugate. What is conjugate? Conjugate will be, you have to change the sign of the denominator. The operation, I mean. So this will be, conjugate will be 2 plus square root of 5. Then this will be over. Whatever we multiply in the numerator, same in the denominator. Okay? Okay, so multiply the numerator. So 3 plus square root of 3. Then 2 plus square root of 5. Note that this is multiplication. So 3 times 2, that is 6. Then this will be plus 2 square root of 3. Then this will be 3 plus 3, I mean square root of 5. Then plus square root of 3 and square root of 5, that will be square root of 15. So bring down 6 plus 2 square root of 3. Since they are not the same, so just copy. This is positive, right? So this will be 3 square root of 5 and then plus square root of 15. So I have now 6 plus 2 square root of 3 then plus 3 square root of 5 then plus square root of 15 then this will be over. Then multiply 2 minus square root of 5 then 2 plus square root of 5 Note that this is multiplication. 2 times 2, that will be 4. This will be negative 2 square root of 5. Then this will be positive 2 square root of 5. Then minus square root of 25. So bring down 4. Negative 2 square root of 5 plus square root 2 square root of 5. This will be cross out. So that will be 0. Then we know that square root of 25 is 5. So 4 minus 5, that is negative 1. So this will be negative 1. 